YouTube, Suron family, this is the update. I just finished doing the new headlight modification install, which is working great. Can't wait to get out and test that on the open road. I am going to do the uh, rear view mirror now, because uh, of course these things don't come with a mirror. And uh, if you haven't checked out my other video, it's uh, on this light and it covers the removal and the installation of this other one. And also talked about my uh, Bluetooth uh, signal lights as well. So here is the mirror and it's gonna go probably right about here, somewhere in here. And uh, let's get to it. All right, so here is the little kit that comes with it. I'm gonna take this apart and hopefully get this thing apart. Here we go. I mean, it would be great if that was the same thickness as my other one, and no, of course it's not. It's a huge freaking bolt, unnecessarily, for our, here we go, our mirror. Turn that off, and find out, well that is a very nice bracket actually, I have to say. I have not seen a hinged bracket like that. It's very nice. All right, so, oh, I see why, because this is also gonna mount the mirror. That's why. So the mirror is gonna go into that slot in a particular way, I see, just like that. Only goes in one way. There we go. There. Still looks like it could go a tiny bit further. Oh, it's all the way down there though. All right, so let's say this is to go here and here. There's plenty of room, so looks like we are going to have to put on the rubber gasket that comes with this. So I've put that inside, sticky side against here, rather than on the handlebar, because if I want to move this and I've stuck it to the handlebar, I'll have to unstick it. All right, so there we go. That's looking good. It's going to be something like that. It's going to be way over here. Wow, I guess you can move. Let me show you. So there is a channel right underneath the controller and I can slide right underneath there it looks like and get it all the way out to the edge which I'm definitely going to want all the way out there. Alright so let's pause here and see if I'm getting this long bolt in the hole. It's, yeah, there's a nut already in there. It's sealed in. That would have been a great idea if they'd have done that for the headlamp. Because the headlamp did not have a holding point for the nut. <clears throat> if you see on the other video, it's kind of long. And that's with me taking out a lot of... Uh, doing a lot of pauses on the other video because there was so much R&D to figure out how to actually make it work. Um, I was hoping there would still be some give in there, but there isn't. And I'm going to have to take the bike off the rack so I can sit on it and test it. My yoga swing there hanging. I know some of you are thinking other things. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. How do we want this light? This mirror. All the way out here. Wow, it's definitely tight now and difficult to move.
So, uh, if I were you, I'd put it as far as possible. So you can see, I'm trying to connect the bolt down into the nut there and squeeze those two together. jiggle while I'm gently tightening it to make sure that any loose edges are weeded out. There. There we go. One mounted rear view mirror. Let's see if we should be able to remove the plastic there. Voila. There we go. Very movable. The other one I had mounted over here I go so fast that the wind would just blow the mirror out of wax. So, and this one's pretty adjustable. There we go. I like it. One mirror modification done. One headlight modification done. There it is. The you can see the white and the yellow, and the yellow and the white. Very happy about both of those modifications and the Bluetooth uh, signal modification. And let's see what's next. What's next? Oh, and the uh, phone holder. That was really good. This thing right here is really great. Phone sits right in here. These are rubber pads. And man, I just <laughs> was doing some brutal stuff in Whistler and it kept my phone on there while I was videoing. So there you go. I uh, hope you uh, enjoyed this video. I hope it's helpful for you. Uh, please like and subscribe. And uh, we'll see what the next uh, modification brings.